It is officially game time. It is time to party. And by party, I mean bench press. You know, I want 240 next week. This session is built to prime me for that. You know, I can justify 240 when I get this. And I've got to earn it, as I always say. Strength is earned. It's not given. Everyone wants handouts. Everyone wants to do things and be something. But they don't want to do the work. That's not how it works, baby. Let's get it. 200, five reps. Let's get this, baby. Off the right. Welcome back to your mum's favourite channel on YouTube. My name's Reese Keane. You know, I'm trying to fucking grow my channel here, but these people seem to want to make that difficult for me. It's real nice, guys, hey? I try to keep this real Christian friendly, you know? I don't like to fucking swear on this channel. Welcome to your mum's favourite YouTube. My name's Reese Keane. I'm going to do 70 kilos now. Fuck you, Johnny. Fuck you, Sarah. It's uh, week 12 of The Barbarian. It's the last week of the program, actually. Uh, testing next week, me and John Boy. That motherfucker, we're gonna do our max testing uh, on Monday, do you reckon, Johnny? Monday. Monday, max testing. Johnny's going for 200. I think it's pretty much safe as houses. And my goals hit 240. Uh, but today, I've got a three by five. Um, see how the shoulder goes. I wanna get at least one set at 200 kilos. And then if it holds up, I'll do the other two sets there as well. Um, but that would be nice, you know, five reps, 200. We're getting back there again. But we'll start with 70. We've got comp plates today. Now I know it just doesn't look as exciting as putting all those big cast iron fucking plates on there, but eh, it is what it is. 25 kilo plates. Let's go, baby. We'll get it done. It's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be another fantastic day. Every day is a fantastic day, isn't it? Isn't it, yes? Let's go. Let's get it. Let's go, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Today we'll go, uh, I like to make 30 kilo jumps when I do the comp plate, so 70, 100, 130, and so on and so forth. So uh, we'll chuck on 100 now. We'll chat in a sec. <clears throat> All right, baby. 100 kilos on the bar. Now, I'm eight weeks out of pro raw powerlifting. I'm pretty fucking excited, to be honest with you. You know, it's getting to that point where uh, I'm starting to uh, kind of obsess over what I'm gonna do on the day even though I shouldn't, it's not healthy, but I still do it because, uh, you know, some would say that I'm pretty fucking crazy. Probably true. But we got 100 kilos now. We'll get four or five reps in, we'll make it easy, uh, and then we'll keep working. You know, as I said, 200 kilos is the goal today. The set to five reps. It's pretty good, it's pretty spicy. We're getting there again, baby. I like it. Let's go. Hoo ya. Make it easy, baby. Just like yo mama. I'm joking. She was actually quite difficult. Took me all night. Took me all night. <laughs> Let's go. Easy work, baby. Let's go. It's uh, feeling a little sore, but I'm guessing it probably warm up a little bit. So give it a couple more sets, and uh, fingers crossed, it feels okay because uh, I do want to push today. Let's go. 
All right, baby, 130 kilos on the bar. And obviously, you know, every time I do a set, I just commit to it, you know, regardless of uh, you know, my, any niggles in my shoulder. There's no hesitation. You know, once I'm underneath the bar, it's 100%. You know, we can't be doing this at 80% or 90%. That's how you, that's how you really get hurt, you know? So we're gonna fucking smoke this shit. Got big John Boy to unrack for me. And uh, please, make sure you are subscribed. If you're watching, just drop a fucking comment. Tell me what you had for dinner. Tell me what you're training today. Whatever. Just fucking do it. And like this video, of course. Let's go, baby. <sighs> Easy work. 130. We have two reps. Oosh. Oosh. Every single rep, perfect positioning. Let's go. Huh. Yeah, buddy. Easy peasy. You know, there was no more pain uh, than when I did 100, so that's good. So I'll chuck on 160 next, and we'll hit that. We'll hit a single there, and I dare say my last warm up will be 190, and then it's game time. So we've got some work ahead of us today. Three by five is a hard session, especially at 200, so it's gonna be good. Let's go. All right, baby, 160 on the bar. Feeling good. I'm gonna move this shit like there ain't nothing on the bar. But just quickly, if you haven't yet, go and check out my Patreon. You know, as I've said, it is dedicated towards mindset, mentality, you know, that sort of content. Uh, be a bit of uh, other stuff as well. A little bit of spirituality, maybe some philosophy, and how that all ties into the psyche. And uh, especially in regards to, as I keep saying, achieving big things because everyone's capable, not everyone's aware, and uh, knowledge is power. Anyway, 160, baby. This is also power. Let's get it. One rep, John Boy. Just a single here, baby. Easy. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Right, nothing, baby. Let's get this. Come on. Let's go, let's go. I felt like, uh, it felt lighter than your mama. I'm not saying your mama's heavy, but it felt lighter than your mama. 190 next, one more warm up. Might even take the pump cover off in case your mama's watching. I know she appreciates it. Let's go. All right, gang, 190 kilos final warm-up as I always fucking say you know, I have to justify you know my desired goal for today which is 200 kilos so this better fucking move easy right got to earn it this isn't one of those wishful thinking situations you know sort of hypothetical it is what it is you're as strong as you are and the iron never lies baby 190 is always 190, isn't it, John Boy? Yes. Let's go. One rep. Yeah, last warm up. Let's go. Come on, baby. This ain't shit. Let's get it. Huh? Easy fucking peasy, motherfucker. Let's go. Whew. Let's go. Easy. Who's? Uh, felt good. Bit of pain in the shoulder. That's okay. I'll commit to this first set. We'll get it done. Then I can uh, feel sorry for myself later. 
But right now, I've got a fucking job to do, and I'm gonna do it. <sighs> All right, baby, it is officially game time. It is time to fucking party. And by party, I mean bench press. Go on some fucking titties. You know what I'm saying? You know, I want 240 next week. This session is built to prime me for that. You know, I can justify 240 when I get this. And I've got to earn it, as I always say. Strength is fucking earned. It's not fucking given. Everyone wants fucking handouts. Everyone wants to fucking do things and be something. But they don't want to do the fucking work. That's not how it works, baby. Let's get it. 200. Five reps. Let's go. Five, baby. Let's get this, baby. Off the right. Let's go. Come on. It's coming, dog. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Two more. One more. Back to me. Let's go. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Pretty good, baby. Pretty good. You know, definitely working out a few kinks in the shoulder, but you know, I'll make the next set better. I'll make it nicer, because uh, it doesn't feel too bad. I'm happy with that. That's the first time I've done you know, that sort of rep range of 200 in fucking years. Let's go. Whew. All right, gang, second set. You know, I'm keeping it real for you. I give myself maybe a seven out of 10 for that last set. Not too bad, but could it be better? Absolutely, it could be better. Could be tighter, could be a little smoother. Obviously, it could be easier, but that's not really what I'm judging it on. I'm judging it on the performance of the set. So there's a couple of things I'll try and tidy up on this set. You know, make it uh, at least a 7.5, you know? We're gonna make some sort of improvement here. That's the goal. Get it, baby. Five reps. Set two. Bye -bye, baby. Eight weeks out, baby. Let's go. Come on, baby. Three more. Come on. Last one. Back to me. Push it back to me. Let's go. Thank you, bro. Well done. So that's it. Uh, it felt it felt nicer. Um, didn't move as easy, you know. But it's a second set. So what I'll do. I'll take a bit of a longer break now, and that third set, I'll come back, and we'll get those five reps out, and again, make it a little bit better. But you know, to be honest, I'm very, very happy with this. It's good to get back to those levels of uh, <laughs> what I would call strong. You know, I'm not saying you're not strong if you can't do this, but I have high standards, for myself especially, so, you know, it feels nice. Feeling big, feeling strong. I'll be ready in eight weeks, baby. Let's go. All right, baby. Set three, 200 kilos. You know, although this is the most fatigued, you know, out of my sets that I will be, you know, my goal is still to make it the best set yet. I took a couple extra minutes of rest. So, you know, hopefully uh, there's a little more gas in the tank than last set. But, you know, I really do want to make this look quite comfortable. It has felt pretty comfortable, to be fair, but it can always feel better and we can always do better. And as we say, it's important to hold a very high standard for yourself. Yes, 
give yourself a pat on the back when it's due, but also don't piss in your own fucking pocket, man. You're only letting yourself down. If you're not producing a fucking high standard, then just fucking do better. Be real with yourself and do better. You know, that's if you want to fucking achieve something. John Boy, let's go, baby. Let's get this. Hello! All fucking day, baby. Let's go. Go. Ah, fuck yeah. Let's get it. Come on, baby. Make it easy. Shh. Come on. Shh. Shh. All you, brother. Shh. Yep. Three. Three. Come on. Four. Last one back to me. Come on. Woo. Yeah, baby. Ha. Yeah, it felt okay. That wasn't my best set. But we got it done. We got it done. It felt a little bit uh, on the second rep. A little bit of a wobble on the left shoulder. But, you know, I fixed it. We got the set done. And I'm pretty happy. You know, as I said, that's the most reps I've done at 200 in years. And I did three sets. So that's big progress. It's important to you know acknowledge progress. I also know I can do better. I know I've got more in me. And I'm excited to unlock that because I know what I'm made of. You know, I know where I've been before. I've done that for 10 reps before. So I know I can do you know more than that. It's just gonna take work. But I'm hungry. Let's go. All right, baby, so three by five at 200, that was successful. And uh, yeah, I'm really happy about that. Um, but now I just want to hit 200 kilos just for a single, but I want to pause it. Just a bit of practice, this is the weight that I worked with today. So I'll just hit a quick single here with a little pause just to familiarize myself with it. You know, each week I'll just add a little bit of weight, you know, and then before you know it, that pause doesn't make a fucking difference. You know, I've never benched more in training uh, in a comp prep than I did in competition. And I don't really pause it much in training. And in competition, I still manage to bench press more than I did in my training cycle. So that does say something, obviously, right? With a single here, and then I might even get an AMRAP set at 160. Um, after that, we'll see how we go. All right, John Boy, just one rep, baby. Go. I'm just gonna pause the fucker. Let's go, baby. I'll just, I'll hold it for a bit. For anyone wondering, you might be wondering why the pause, uh, if you do compete in powerlifting competitions, you have to adhere to certain commands and one of them is a pause command. So you have to pause it until you get a press call. Uh, that's the reason why. Let's get this baby. One rep. Easy. Let's go. Uh, very easy. And that's, to be honest, a lot longer than you'd have to pause in competition. But again, just getting familiar in that position. There's no worries at all. That feels nice and strong, nice and easy. Happy days, so load 160. I'd like to get like 15. It might be tough after all that volume, but we'll give it a crack, baby. Let's go. <laughs> is, is it like, is it super gay to like touch yourself then? It's not. That's probably the gayest thing to do. It probably is. It wouldn't surprise me. Let's go. 15 reps, 160. 15 reps, maybe 16. <laughs> Shut your fucking mouth. Let's go. Bonus round. Level up. Hopefully it's not a fatality. So I'll save it. <laughs> I got you. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Five. 
10. Well, morning. You got 16. If then you got one more, right? <laughs> oh, yes. You could have done 16. I'm not gay, though. Sarah! Sarah! <laughs> not that there would be a problem if I was. There's nothing wrong with that. Is there, Johnny? There isn't. Let's go! <laughs> and uh, there is the session done. A very, very successful day. You know, a lot of volume. Uh, 16 total reps at 200, which includes that single with a pause. And then another 15 reps at 160. You know, so that's, uh, that's a lot of pressing volume. Um, and you know, the reason I did that today is that my next bench press session on uh, Thursday will be the final bench press session before uh, max testing. And the plan for that session is to reduce the volume quite drastically. Um, to recover for max testing, which will be on Monday, Tuesday next week. Um, so, you know, I give myself a good week to get, you know, to recover from that volume. And I think for me, in a sense, it makes, it makes sense um, to not be fully recovered for my max testing, because although it is a max testing, my competition is still eight weeks away. So I need to be thinking about, I need to be as strong as possible in eight weeks time. So I don't want it to really be, you know, a true max. You know, I don't want to be like a refreshed, deloaded, this is what I've got in the tank sort of day I want to come in. Uh, just as a part of a training program, hit a nice single at 240, uh, keeping in mind that the following week, uh, I'm not resetting, I'm still working. It's still going to be heavy benching for another seven weeks after that, because obviously I'd like to put up more than 240 at competition. You know, if I can get close to 250, that would be unreal. Uh, and the way things are moving at the moment, that doesn't seem too far-fetched. Uh, my best press in competition is 252 and a half kilos so you know we'd be getting back close to that which would be really cool you know um, so i'm excited for that uh, my shoulder feels pretty good it's a bit of pain i didn't feel any pops or cracks in there today though so that's really positive so i'm definitely confident that by next week uh, it will be close to 100 percent um you know but i'm going to enjoy the rest of the day the training is done it's a monday it's a good way to start the week you know uh, chest day so monday is obviously international chest day but uh, it's important how we start our week, how we start our day. If we start our week on a Monday <laughs> and we don't go to the gym, well, you're not gonna have a very strong week, are you? You know, if uh, strength is important to you, you know, if discipline and, and obviously achieving things is important to you, set your routine and be strict with it. Now that's my advice to you. And obviously, if you wanna support Cult Strength, please head to my Patreon, uh, patreon.com forward slash Cult Strength. The link's in my bio. You know, less than a, it costs less than a cup of coffee a week. Uh, and you get obviously uh, exclusive content and we're gonna be doing live Q and A's and things like that. So you'll get an opportunity to interact with me more uh, and the group, you know, so we can discuss all things mentality, mindset, bit of mental health, all things that tie in, things that make us better. You know, that's the goal for that, that platform. So for those of you who are on there, you know, we'll be chatting soon, obviously, but if anyone wants to check it out, head over there. And until next time, you know what to do? Go to the fucking gym. <laughs>